case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a 2008 case heard by the United States Court of Appeals for the Seventh Circuit, Michael Sanders, Taufika Fanja, and Fulashade Moore were involved in smuggling 3.6 kilograms of heroin into the U.S. from Nigeria. After a controlled delivery, Sanders pleaded guilty and received a 10-year sentence, while Afanja and Moore were arrested and each sentenced to over 10 years in prison. Afanja claimed a prosecution witness did not meet the requirements of Rule 702 and called for his testimony to be inadmissible. The court emphasized that when an expert proposes to testify, the judge must ensure that the testimony is based on sufficient facts or data, reliable principles and methods, and can be applied reliably to the facts of the case by applying the three criteria in Rule 702. Although the court held Coleman's testimony admissible, it warned district judges, prosecutors, and defense counsel to ensure that expert witnesses met Rule 702 standards. Afanja's conviction was upheld, while the appeals of Sanders and Moore were dismissed as frivolous. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsc.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class. 